Time Real Course, love it, check it out, Hindhead. Keep drawing. Sure. Hopefully that's just sat there and not rolled on, because that's perfect. The giveaway for Spain is now live. Tag everyone. Are you carrying me on the outs, are you? We can break minus 10. Comment below if you think we can do it. And don't forget to go to Instagram, share the best story of the trailer for this video, and I'll see you in Spain. I'd love to see you in Spain. Let's go. I'm buzzing with that front nine. Come on, the boy! Get in there! We're three under. Be nice to have a bogey free round. I haven't had one for a while. But get on that landscape. Get on that beautiful course. Right, we just walked past this tee box, or this fairway, sorry, um, off the 18th. So I think anywhere down the left side is good. But get on the shot trace on this backdrop. Five yard draw. Look at the bounce. That is P1 position, not A1. We call it P1. We should call it S1, isn't it? Swig position one. Get on that, you swiggers. Money earner there. 94 is there. Got 80, that doesn't look 85 yards. Um, yeah, 56, it's slightly downwind. Pins at the back, it looks like the green all slopes. It's all uphill, left to right, so try and stick it below the pin or in the L would be nice. Right, keep this low because of the fucking wind. That's more like it. Look at that square divot. Squarer than Harry Maguire's forehead, that. Hardest. That's one of the um, golf shots I've been working on, actually, this summer. Normally, I would have hit a 56 there, tried to flight it. Wind or no wind, you just get no control. But I just played a gap wedge, a knockdown gap wedge, just to control it a bit more. I've been trying to keep it inside six feet. This is way inside six feet. This is probably Marco's sort of height, five foot, I reckon, five foot five. Six one, maybe? Keep the head still, roll the putt, go four under, offer Rick Shields out because he's an absolute giraffe. Downhill, wind off the right, blind tee shot, you won't see where the ball lands. So, baby draw, let the wind just bring it across. Yeah, sensational. That's got miles. Come on. New caddy on the bag, is it? Are you caddy me on the Alps tour, are you? Right, we've got a short shot in. 152 there. Probably got about 148 on a par five, because it's downhill, so I don't understand why it's a par five. It should be a par four, really. Slightly uphill, pins in the middle. Solid nine iron, I think. I'm not going to use a nine. No, I'm going to do a bit of wind as well up there. I'm going to play a softer eight and just get on the dance floor. I want an eagle putt here. We're four under, nothing to lose. Just a soft eight. Like that. Middle of the dance floor. 
so up and down for another Virgo 5 under, let's get it. Right, we haven't had an eagle for a while. Very outside chance of an eagle. But this is just about getting it inside three feet, giving ourselves a tap and birdie to go five under. I'm telling you now, tag Jimmy Billard, tag Rick Shields, tag Peter Finch, tag everyone. There's not a man alive in Surrey or the UK that will beat me on this course, and I guarantee you it. You know when a course suits your game, this is a course that suits my game. And I'll put any money on the line to any charity against anyone that I've beaten around Hindhead, and it's the first time I've played it. So it's a life second. I played one as a junior, but as an adult. Right, inside three feet, little left to right. Get it up there close. That should be good for pace. To break the absolute opposite way. That's because I've given it the bigging against all these uh, so-called golfers. Right, let's tap in the bird. Let's go five under. Get in there. That's how you play a hole. Don't know how that's a par five anyway, but five under, let's go. Keep giving that little left uppercut, don't I? Bang, bang, Josh Kelly, eat your ass out. Cameraman's dying. Thinks he's a football athlete. Tell you what, these, this is carpet. This is a lovely little par three. Got about 180, got a seven iron. Pins at the front, got bunker either side. It's a tight landing spot, this. If you offer me a par right now, I'd take it, but we're playing well, we're striking it well. Just control this down there, like a punchy shot. Ah, it's drifting to the right slightly, but we'll be okay. Left myself a nasty little chip to get up and down there, I think. I don't know what's over on the right. <laughs> right, well, just off the green on the right. Should we get this up and down? This is a hard up and down this. It'll be tough to stop it. Try and get some spin on it. Played it well, but I just didn't play it on the right bit of the contour. Little pass save, I wanted it a bit higher up here. Just let it roll down the bank, just didn't get enough of it, but pace was good. A little left to right up. Come on. Don't pressure myself because I don't want to make a bogey. Get in there. That's a great pass save, that. That's probably the best save of the day. That's better than some of the birdies. Tough little par three, that. Great up and down. The round continues. Five under. No bogeys, ladders. Par five, and it's a race against the light. And I don't want the round to stop. Whilst you're playing like this, you just want to continue playing. And uh, we're hole four, technically hole 13 on the, on the round. Five, three, six, par five. Beautiful down, downhill. Quite narrow. It does require a good shot off the tee. And I've picked up the three wood. <laughs> Get tired, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's a great shot. It's leaked a little right. I'm 
I'm hoping it's not in the heat, but it's mild. It's right behind them, so hopefully you know the big dog's arrived. So we can speed past them because we've got the catch. Sunset. This is going to be the lowest round of golf that I've ever shot on camera. I say that, we haven't filmed that much, but this ball's just traveled an absolute mile. We're on a par five. Just look at this, the sun's falling, an absolute zone. We've got 222 into the pin. So again, another reachable par five. Chance to make another birdie, even an eagle. What are we, five under? We've got five holes to play after this. We can break minus 10. Comment below if you think we can do it. And don't forget to go to Instagram, share the best story of the trailer for this video. And I'll see you in Spain. I'd love to see you in Spain. Let's go. 222. That's perfect, but it's a bit left of the pin. We're dancing. We have another eagle putt. than it looks that. God, I didn't think it was going to get there. I did not think that was going to get there. And it's gone past the hole. They're speeding up these greens. But, little birdie chance. What's that to go, Marco? Says. Single says. says. Six under. This is a tough little snapper, this. This if Marco was a hole or a putt, this would be him. Six short, feet. Short, sharp. The snappy. Good <laughs> part to get in there. Come on. The thing is, yeah, is I, I'm buzzing off my kit. I'm shattered. I'm so tired. I've got like an adrenaline dump because I was so buzzing with the start, but now I'm so tired. We've got through these, um, like holes and I've made a couple of birdies on the front of this one as well, but it's not hitting the same because I'm shattered. But anyway, we're on to the next. The white tee box, we are having a little cheat here, is just here. The steps to it are miles and I'm shattered, but it's the same distance because it's in line with the yellow. And I've teed it back just to make sure it's dead in line. So we've got 375, par four, dog leg, driver's too far, so I've got a two iron, which I hopefully will play to about 260, 270. So a little draw. like that. I'm absolutely striking it. <coughs> That's A1. Come on. Let's pick the energy up, baby. So we got 160 in. Wasn't a great strike, to be honest. It looked nice on the shot chase. It's a good shape. I just didn't catch it clean. It was a bit high in the face. Um, probably went about 240. We just went for people to get up the green. It started to rain. What a Keep shot. Drawing. Go. Keep drawing. Keep drawing. Shot. Hopefully that's just sat there and not rolled off because that's perfect. I feel that anyone else would be buzzing six under and deep down I'm absolutely buzzing, but I am shattered. I've eaten jack all all day. I've had a sausage bat this morning and then that's it. So I've had them and just had the love arts in the car. Oh yeah, we had half a packet of love arts, didn't we? <laughs> um, oh, and all these hills we've got to walk up. Lovely green. Beautiful little hole. Bit of mud on the ball. Pitch pin high. Can't even clean it, but we'll give it a roll. Right to left, slightly uphill. Playing this a bit quick because it's an outside birdie chance and it's tipping it down. Just get the pace right, make a path. 
or make a birdie, or make a birdie, or make, oh my gosh, that could have been seven under. I thought that was in, did you think that was in the whole way? <laughs> oh, take a part, on we go. But we're a team. but just off to the right. Ugh, a bit up and down. shot of the day. Pulled in. Back to five under. Back to five under. I felt like that was a bit of a rushed hole. It's always the way when someone lets you through, isn't it? You try and brush it, but we'll just give this a big whack down there to make up for it. We're still five under, remain positive. Five under with seven, eight, three to play. Loop a little right. Having that period during the round, but you find yourself in a bit of a lull. All that adrenaline's dumped, just dropped a shot. But I'm still five under, just blocked a shot. But I'm still five under. <laughs> Shank the next shot, you're still good at golf. That's what I need to tell myself, it's just a mental battle. And there's always in a round adversity. That's why golf's beautiful. You're never gonna have a smooth sailing round. And up until now, 14 holes in, I had no bogeys and it was going smoothly. Bit of rain, bit of wind, getting dark, then it's lightened up. Have to play through a few people. It's golf. We just got to make sure we don't get silly or make any silly mistakes. We came here to break par. We're on course to do so. We came here to not three putt. We're yet to do so. So, remain positive, get up and down from here. Make a birdie on the way out and a par. Get in the clubhouse, offer Rick Shields out on my next YouTube channel. That's what we do, Gladys. Just realized we um, played it off the wrong tee box, again in line with the white, but it was lower. That last hole, you got to get stuff like that out of your head because I was a yard away from greatness there. And um, literally a yard left, and we had an easy birdie putt. But so is golf. And let's find my ball in the lavender. Found my ball, we're deep in this. Rough. Very narrow fairway, so it's not actually a bad drive. I was a bit steep on it. Let's try and get out of this stuff. Be a miracle if we get this on the green. There, come right out to the left. We're in the fairway. Sure. That's Jurassic Park here, isn't it? Fuck. You can only just see your head above it. <laughs> Gotta try and get up and down here. Probably got about 50 yards. I don't think it's as close as it looks. Don't go close to it. 
That's a big hell. part. Sorry, excuse the language. That is a sigh of relief. That could have started slipping away on the last three holes. Don't know if you can feel it watching it. We need to pick this momentum up big time. Get back into that vibe. A tough par three, 17th. Technically eight. Really small landing spot. I've changed the ball actually. We've gone with a Callaway. Ooh, right. Come out right at it. Oh my. Uh, that's it, it's front to the green. That's rolled onto the green, Mitch. Just got it, I think. It's going to be surprised. Oh, I'm flagging now. That was a lazy shot. Pushed it to the right. Have a little chip down there, I think. Bad tired swing. Here we get this close. We're on the fences here, on the ropes. Land are too soft. I knew I had the wrong club there. You're joking me. Oh my days. The last three holes have been a struggle. I need to just find the strength. Back down to four under. I need to find the strength to hit a good drive off this last tee box. Thank you so much for watching so far. Um, it's been a marathon for me. Should have definitely eaten more, but unreal round so far we need to finish strong you can probably sense i'm flagging but um again really grateful for you watching really grateful for the comments the shares and i hope to see two of you in spain very soon and also we gave away something on the front nine which was a round at hindhead with me i'll do that for two people to make up a four ball with me and meatball um so yeah make sure you enter both of those make sure you like and subscribe to this video turn on the little bell so you get notification when we post the next one um Let's find the energy to finish strong here, people. Let's go. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, that was it's such a good strike. But that took so much energy to hit that. It's probably about 30 yards less than how I normally swing it. But listen, we're down there. Find the energy to find the green two putt, finish with a tidy four under. It means we've broken what we set out to do. We've not three putted yet. Um, and yeah, unreal course, love it. Check it out, Hindhead. Make sure you uh, enter the competition because I'd love to play two of you. Uh, I can't even find the words to talk, so I'm so tired. That McDonald's down the road is getting stopped at instantly. Strawberry milk, shake me up. Cheers. Beautiful hole, 134 left up the hill. Got to find the energy for this last shot. Two putt, get out of here, four under. Have to. Stick it in for birdie, no? Love that from you, Meatball. Come on. That's the energy Come I on. need. He's been hiding, and he's been flagging. All right. Come on, one last good swing. For that side, I feel like I have to throw. Oh, it's all day. Oh, please be good. Please go in. Please go in. Oh my God. Oh, God. <laughs> I deserve this. I don't feel like I deserve to be shooting just for oh. him. Don't, don't feel like I should be shooting four under. Like, it's a joke. It's played unreal. Come here, you little birdie. I deserved it. Come on. Five under. <laughs> I could fall backwards, but I'm too tired to get back up. Come on! Hello, Mish. Thank you, mate. That was uh, literally such an exhaust. Look at the state of the wig. Exhausting round. But just get on that scenery before I give a sign-off note because it's just sensational. Honestly, just a sensational course. 
an unreal round. We were flagging at the end, but um, thank you Hindhead for inviting us down to play. Thank you Marco for the camera work. Thank you everyone for watching. So grateful to, to have you all following the journey. To me, you're all swiggers, and hopefully I get to play with you all soon. Um, we're gonna be doing a junior championship at Kingswood, which I can't wait. It's gonna be a winter edition, which is great. Can't wait for some of you to come out to Spain. Can't wait for some of you to be here. Thankful for all of you, um, and yet again, make sure you do like and subscribe because it keeps everything going. Much love, I'll see you at the top.